All right, so in the past I've done a video on uh, windshield wipers and I had to glue mine back together. You can look that up. But uh, as with everything, I like to do things right. So that was a temporary fix and got me through until I could take care of it properly. I'm at the house now and uh, I'll tell you, the, uh, I had a quote to get this all fixed and it was $1,800 to get the windshield wipers fixed they quit working one day but um i got all the parts now um you got a, a rotator arm right here that's new uh this stud right here <clears throat> that threaded stud is what broke off my last one i've already done that side i got the two new rods two new cross rods and these are all held on by c clamps Eclipse actually uh, They come apart real easy uh, $1,800 is what I was quoted to fix it uh, So far I've got $400 put into it and that's with a new windshield wiper arm that cost damn near $200 the rest of it uh, This was a hundred uh, the bars are only like 50 bucks a piece and uh you know, it's it's a whole lot cheaper to do it yourself. Now I'm going to show you how to position them. Uh, you ever do windshield wiper arms? Make sure you get one of these. It's a sleeve. It's a little geared geared ring. You'll notice, and it's ovaled out. So this goes on here, all right. And that's what positions your your windshield wiper arm. Your windshield wiper arm has a spring lock in it, a spring load right here, and this will fold over. Take a cotter key like I got over there, and uh, they can stick it right through. This this is a new one, so this comes with a rod in it. But you can stick a cotter key through there, and it'll keep it straight. Make sure you do this so that you can get this all the way on without stripping the threads. If you strip those threads, you're in a world of trouble. Make sure you get it, get it right. The other little things to watch out for are your your spray. Make sure you make sure you get your your spray right. Um, and all you're gonna do is just lock it on there. All right, get it positioned where you want it, which is for me. Shelf should be fine, and then I'll lock it down with a, a um, I'll lock it down with a nine sixteenths uh, locking locking nut, and that's a well, you get it. I'll show it to you when I'm finished. It. It's all said and done. I got it all done. Don't ask me how this happened. Can't explain it. Well, yeah, put the bar upside down or something. But now the windshield wipers go back and forth like a regular car. They don't go in and out, in and out. But all said and done, we're good to go. Tick, tock, tick, tock. So. There you go.